Hey everyone, Corey here from the Super Cool Nerd Show and we are at the Comic-Con Museum in San Diego, California. This building was donated to Comic-Con in 2017, or rather offered to them, and they began work in 2021. Now, 2024, they should either be finished with their work or they will be finishing up their work this year. So why don't we go take a look at what's here? All right, so we're doing a scavenger hunt with the Comic-Con Museum, and the first thing is the, this Batman statue. We have to figure out what issue number it's based on and who the artist is. Let's see. Um, all right, so it's Batman number 423 by Todd McFarlane. All right, so we've been searching this place for a while, trying to find uh, what is the temporal conundrum from Back to the Future. We finally found it. It's the letter. The letter shouldn't have existed because they were written for Marty. Uh, it could jeopardize everything. But we found it. We finally found it. All right, so next question we're looking at, which dreamer or visionary do you think would be surprised to see their predictions become reality? And they want us to like, what the prediction is, all that. I think it would be Paul Krugman. He didn't think that the internet would be that significant. It would be like a fax machine, which is very obsolete these days. And I think he'd be surprised to see how wrong he was. <laughs> if that's not the right answer, oh well, I'm going with it. I think it's great. <laughs> So we have to find a robotic milestone from our decade that we were born. And I'm old, so I had to look in the 1980s. And I found Nintendo's Rob, R-O-B. It was the first robot buddy with video games. It had two games you could play with it. And, not listed here, was why the NES was popular. Saved gaming, thank the robot. Welcome to the robotics area of Popnology, where we'll unravel how movie magic sparked astonishing innovations in our very own world. So think about this. Back in the day, when movies showcased robots that beat, booped, and zoomed around, who would have guessed we'd end up with bots roaming our own streets? All right, we finished the scavenger hunt, which means I officially know everything there is to know about nerds and science. That's it. <laughs>